can't you get someone in here to help? Come back to Italy with us, stay a few months. I can't stay a few months, uh, a few weeks maybe, but uh, I don't want to abandon the neighborhood. I, I've been here for 20 years. I want Stefana to know you. She will, right, honey bunny? You will. Shut the fuck up! Shut the fuck up! Taking the kid and I'm walking out of here. Yeah, not leaving yeah, here with the girl. What the hell I'm not. Ronnie! Ronnie, you okay? Spider-Man who saved the day! <laughs> you always joke. <laughs> Any news on the leukemia treatment? Well, it's official. Prilo is the only drug for Ian. Is there any more information on it? Dr. Delito said if we had a quarter of a million cash, we may be able to get the drug in Europe. Even if we liquidate everything, we still won't have enough. Today, Ian said that he didn't want to talk about how he felt. He said that... I know. I know. He knows it makes us feel bad. We're not going to let him. <sighs> it's this new gang of drug dealers that we just can't seem to nail. They're always one step ahead of us. We got a tip from a reliable source that there's going to be a huge deal going on at this nightclub later on. Our subject, Rolando Ortiz, is supposed to be there. Sir, what do we know about this dirt bag? Lieutenant, what's your intel? Uh, these photographs are from 2003. This gang is under investigation for the disappearance of two undercover DEA agents. They were about to make a buy from Rolando. They're still missing and presumed dead. Simply stated, ladies and gentlemen, he's a ruthless savage. Let's watch our ass on this. We'll have narcotics and emergency services to take them down. There will be further details at the TAC meeting. 
One last item. Let's have a hand for Jack, who single-handedly saved Uncle Sal, owner of our favorite deli. And there's a note here. Jack, I think I'll have your partner come up and announce it. Marie, you have the floor. Since when do you go to Sal's Deli without me? <laughs> <laughs> all kidding aside, Jack, all the guys have come together and raised $3,800 for Ian's treatment. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Okay, guys, let's hit the street. Yeah! Let's go! Thanks. Yes, Ian Peterson. We we're hoping to get him into the clinical trials or the actual drug. Yes, Prilo. I know it's not approved yet, but like I said, we're trying to get him into the clinical trials. If the clinical trials are over, then when will the drug be available? When will it be approved? How long is that going to take? Days, weeks, months? What do you mean it could be years? My son doesn't have years. Put together a collateral package? What is that? What do you want? My house? My car? My son's little goddamn red wagon? Take it all. I just want my son to be okay. What about a black market? What do you mean there's no black market? I'm a goddamn cop and I know there's a black market for everything. How can you tell me I can't get a drug in the United States that you have available in Europe? I have a son that's gonna die, do you hear me? You can't let my boy die. You can't let my boy die. Ian is not gonna die. Yes. I really appreciate that. I called you back. Tucci, I got another tip. They're gonna hit us tonight at the palace. You better be careful, because I don't trust your source. I'll call to cancel right now. No, we don't cancel. What do you mean you don't cancel? We gotta give the cops something. What? Go to the palace and bring everything here. The money and the coke. Tucci, I am not Finish, except for a dime bag and a few pesos. Yeah. <laughs> Why bother leaving them shit for? Because the cops are bringing out all the armor for a big bust. And we are going to shit on the show of force. And because I am a sick motherfucker. Wake up, piece of cabron! What the fucking door? Motherfucker! Let's go! What's the door? Orlando. shoved it to us. How the fuck did they know we were coming? Get me Julio Fuentes, all right? Got it, Jack. Julio! I ain't talking to no fucking cops. This your son? I got none to say to you. He's a cute kid. Baseball player. You know, whenever I see people with pictures of their kids, I think maybe they're okay. How many times I gotta tell you? Don't be a dumb shit. You were set up, man. They knew we were gonna bust this place. 
and they let you take the fall. Bullshit. Oh, they let you fall hard, my friend. Look around, where are your buddies? They were told to stay away. It's fucking bullshit. Julio, think about it. If you don't give us something, your son's gonna be older than Alex Rodriguez before you get out. You got nothing on me, cop. Nothing! What the fuck is that? I say it's enough to show intent to sell. That shit ain't mine. It was planted for us to find. Looks like you're the fall guy after all. Say goodbye to little Jose. Wait! Fuck, wait. His name is Rolando, alright? Lives at 750 East 115th Street. Fuck! Day jobs. Give me your fucking weapons. Just make the biggest mistake of your life, motherfucker. Get up! What's the door? Go get the motherfucker and bring it to me! Cojones to disrespect you like this! I will help Competition? I thought you killed them all. What about your fucking informant? Tucci, enough. The only person who knew that we moved this stash here was Julio. Uh. Welcome back, Chico. How you got out so quick? Rolando, you know these cops are stupid. I just told them I was there to dance. <laughs> I bet you sing. As good as you dance. As a matter of fact, I think you sing just like Ricky Martin. No, man. Vive la vida loca. That's no. why they let you go, motherfucker. I wouldn't snitch, okay? I would never snitch. Hmm. I, I wouldn't do that. Who do you tell about us moving the stash to my house? Did you send someone to rob me? I don't know nothing about that, man. What the fuck are you talking about? Because I can't get this shit straight. After we left, I picks food at the club. This guy goes to my house using a pig's mask and robbed me. I don't fucking know, Rolando. I don't know. Do you know what I hate? I hate rat. Do you know what I do to rats? <coughs> Tucci! Help me out, man. Rolando, I was always loyal to you. Always, man. I took that fucking rap for you, man. That shit oh. wasn't... That's true. That's true. Remember, guys? I cut me loose, man. You did take a rap from me. I apologize, man. My bad. I'm sorry, man. I will take that into consideration. One of my informants has info about who tipped off Rolando about the palace. He was scared to tell me through the phone. Okay. Let's go pay him a little visit. Okay. Glad you guys can make it. Come inside. Don't worry, Jack. This is the guy I was telling you about. He's my informant. 
You're working with this piece of shit? What are you calling piece of shit? Pig. You're making a big mistake here. <laughs> Listen to Mr. Piggy here. Nah. Nah. Taking my money. I'm fucking with my drugs. That. What's a big mistake? I don't know what you're talking about! The goddamn money is! He knows! He knows! He knows what? I know it was you. You pawned the toy. You asshole. She found you piggy mask. Hey, Mary, how you doing? Have a safe tour. Thanks, Sarge. Tough, and a woman. Take this bitch back. Uh, Listen to me. I've been hitting her for a long time, Jack. I'll be hitting her from the front. And I'll be hitting her from the back. Now, if you don't tell me where my money stands, you'll be watching your sweet and precious family die. <laughs> What's so funny, Pig? You fucking jerk off. If I don't make a call to a van of cops in the next two minutes, they're gonna be in here with guns drawn pointed at your fat head. What the hell is he talking about? What I'm talking about is that cops always let back up know where they are. This place is gonna be crawling with cops real soon, so you better get the fuck out of here! Shit, boss, we gotta get out of here. Tucci! Marie wouldn't do that to me. She knows what would happen if she betrays me. Now, if he doesn't give me my money back, I'll be visiting the Peterson household. And I'll be introducing myself to your wife and your little leukemia boy. 420 Prescott Avenue, Bronx, New York, home of the swine. Maybe his wife will enjoy some of this. Latin love, motherfucker. Maybe we let Ian watch. Boss! Before we do this guy, let's at least look outside. Tie his ass up and take it to the back. You two guys, jump in the car and drive around before this piece of shit shits on himself. Call me if you see anything funny. Are you okay? You piece of shit. How much is he paying you? You don't understand. I understand that my partner is screwing this punk and giving him information. You don't understand. It's more complicated than that. Understand? You're a traitor. He is my son's father, Jack. He has custody and he keeps him upstate with his mother and he barely lets me see him. Rolando promised me to give me my son back if I helped him. Otherwise, I would never see him again. Your son. I had his baby when I was 17. He is sick, Jack. He is a psycho. He's been haunting me for years. His threats are real. I had no choice. You idiot. Why didn't you come to me? I could have helped you. What the fuck were you thinking? He told me he would let you go as soon as he got his money back. I tossed his coke all over him. He looked like a fucking snowman. I humiliated him in front of his people. How the fuck is he going to let me go? If I don't get free from here, we're both going to die. You guys are talking too much. I'm telling you, shut the fuck up. What was that? Go check it out. It's over, Rolando. Put the gun down now. But it'll hurt my friend, motherfucker. Don't worry. I got you. Take the shot. Don't worry. I got you. Shooting, Rolando. Take the shot. Take the shot. Shooting, Rolando. Shooting now. Put the gun down now. Take the shot. Yeah! The 
Because you know why Dutch was in a wheelchair? He took a bullet for me! He saved my life! Jack! I'm coming for you! You'll never touch my son. Honey, this is Sal from the deli. It's nice to meet you. Daddy, <laughs> tell her. Sal got it for us. We're going to Italy, baby! Wait, start over. Sal's son is a researcher. We got the drug, honey. We're going to Italy. Oh, my God. Oh, Sal, God, how can we ever thank you? He's getting the drug. All the records have been sent to Milan. We can leave in the morning. Oh, God, Sal, we are so... Oh, grateful. You know how we feel about Jack. He saved us. We'll never forget it. Mommy, Sam taught me how to say words in Italian. Grazie, Bella Infinita. That means thank you, pretty nurse. <laughs> now get the tickets, get on the plane, get to Rome, get the medicine. Arrivederci, <laughs> Roma! A mysterious briefcase was left by this door by an anonymous person. It resulted in the donation of $440,000 in cash. Security's camera showed that the money was left there by someone in a pig's mask. The authorities are still investigating this incident. Richard Whitaker, TV One News. Chan, back to you.